Just fire it, stop window! Yep. What's up people, Flez here, and welcome back to another Milsim series. This one is Warzone's Op Sledgehammer at Senny Bridge. Similar to Stanton and Copil that you might see me play recently, Senny Bridge is also a Fibua site. Okay, so the situation, essentially we're going back in time to when Kosovo Liberation Army, KLA, fought the Serbian Armed Forces, SAF. Currently, I'm Commander of Wolf 1, and we're fighting on the SAF side. We were dropped in in the night time, obviously I don't have the footage because it was pitch black, but we dropped in on a simulation helicopter drop in this location here. Essentially we tabbed in and took the fight straight to the KLA. We managed to take control of quite a few buildings in the night, and you couldn't rejoin us on first light as we were trying to flank round and basically attack them at the rear. We dropped down onto the road because it leads all the way round to the rear of the enemy, Plus, it has the wood line and a burn to stop us from being seen from inside the village. Halfway down, we move into the woods and basically start to plan our attack onto the village. We leave half the squad in the wood line to basically provide an ambush position to attack any enemy players coming to retake building 8, while the rest of the squad assaults it. Mats, enemy! Get in, get in, get in! Get in! We really took the enemy by surprise here because they didn't even shoot at us because they weren't sure what team we were on. So we were pretty much in the building firing back. You can hear me shouting guys to get in the building fast because literally, if they're out in the open, they're going to get took out and I want as many guys in this building to defend it as possible. We're literally taking fire from everywhere now and we're pretty much pinned yeah. in this ground floor so it pretty much yeah, yeah. is just a final stand to hold out. The bad. ambush team's being taken out and there's about 15 or 20 plus enemy players outside the building towards 18 coming to our location. Hey, who's got the command comes? He's dead. Are oh, you back in? Kelly, get it, get fucking in. How many of you in here? Just oh, fucking hell. Right the rear! Right on the rear! No, don't worry about it. It's fucking. Tag ground's gone in, right by him. Why aren't they exploding? As you can see there, I fired the tag round off and it landed right next to three guys behind building 18 but for Someone some reason me. it didn't explode. Chris, are you still in? Chris! Ready! Lads, we're getting fucking tuck, tuck right out here, you know. Left hand side of the door. Get that frag out the left hand side! Ready! Ready! Left hand side! Left hand side! Left hand side, lads! He's his IV, he's IV. Can you keep that corner, yeah? Throw that gas in, lad. 
Gas me in, yeah? Gas in. I've got one tagged round left. They don't seem to be fucking exploding, though. You've got, got contacts left. Yeah, yeah. They're in between ours and the fucking... They're in between our players and friendlies. Be aware. Enemy in between Ready. ours. Dan, get shot from your side, yeah? Ready. Ready. We can't. We're fucking stretched, mate. Don't worry about it. You can hear me shout there to Tom that the guy needs an IV. Basically, you get a tourniquet each. Once you go down, someone can tourniquet you back in. But once you get hit again with the tourniquet, you then need an IV bottle and you must drink it. But the only person that has them is the section medic. Is this guy dead? Are these two guys dead on the left? Are these two guys dead on the left here? Fuck! Guy! Jippy on the left! Jippy on the left! Oh, he's on right down side! Look at Dad, stay there! Tag round going out! Where's the tank? See him. Yes! The down! Behind the tanks down! Tag round went in! Tag round went in, boys! Stay in the fucking fight, yeah! We still got contact! Left hand side! Left hand side! Left hand side! We managed to hold out for quite some time there. Obviously, I've cut the footage down so it was easier to watch. You should have seen the amount of dead guys that were outside. There was at least 15 plus enemy players just lying on the ground waiting to be medic back in so we did really smash them. Stay tuned for part two where we take the same route but it turns out a bit different. If you enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Also comment below and tell me what you think if there's anything you'd do different in this situation. As always stay tuned for the next video. Hello you want to buy handy? Look latest models. <laughs> latest models. <laughs> the screen don't work. It's because he'll not turn it on, stupid boy. Oh, fuck, yes. <laughs>